Hello, hello, hello. I'm Nikki from Exotic Party Creation. So today I'm going to show you how to edit your big head fan using our templates in Adobe Photoshop. I am using Adobe Photoshop Element 6. However, you could uh, use any type of editing program software that you have to include um, Canva. So once you open your files, these here, you'll see that they are um this file here has several images to include this one so how you would pull your images from these files so i'm going to start off with a new board and i'm going to do it in inches the width is going to be 18.5 inch at 28 inches high at 300 dpi and you want to make sure that you are on rgb color i'm going to start off with this bottom here file, this is going to be um, a part of the template. So I'm going to cut this away from the image. By doing an edit cut, and I am just going to go ahead and replace that there. I'm going to go here to my new file and drop it in. And of course, this here part of the graduation fan came in with it. I do not need that. So I am going to just erase this portion of it. Now I am going to go over here where my numbers are and I'm going to do the same thing. I am just going to cut this out here. I'm going to use the gold 2023. Edit cut. Redo it so that it can remain on that image and I'm just going to go over here and paste it. I'm going to line it up with this here image and of course it came in with the white background. I am just going to take off the background here so that you can be able to see it. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just going to erase the white from um, behind it. And then now I'm gonna go ahead and insert it within this here template. It needs some adjusting, not a problem. Just bring it up and align it how you would like within this template. Now you're ready to bring in your graduate image. All right, so I have my graduate, graduate image and of course I am going to just drag that over as well. Let's bring this out. And basically I'm just gonna adjust it down to size. So as you saw that I did this template as an 18.5 inch at 28 inch in height, that's because we will be using the 20 by 30 inch foam board and you want to uh, leave some room so that you can have enough area on the foam board left just in case you make any errors while applying your um, custom print. All right, so once you have your image over, I am gonna lock these. I'm gonna hide her really quickly. I am going to group those so that when I get ready to move, they all move at one time. And I am gonna just maybe go in just a tad bit on the side, add her back in. And there you have it. If you want to, you can still make adjustments here. I'm going to get my eraser tool and just kind of blend her in within a frame. All right, so there's our image. Now, if you decide you want to go ahead and print your image out with us, how you would um, send it over for print, you would do another blank file. Um, you can do up to 24 inches wide at 30 inches in height. Be sure you put your um, board at 300 DPI RGB color and press OK. 
And now what you can do is select all of this at one time and transfer it over to your uh, image that you're going to want us to print. So this is how you would set your 24 inch by 30 inch um, file up to send to us for print. Here you have some extra space. You can always, you know, add some smaller items just so that you do not uh, waste any of your um, paper. Let's go ahead and merge those layers. This here is coming out to about six inches. Let's just make several other copies of this one. All right, and this is how you would use your 24 inch by 30 inch, and this is what you would call a gang sheet. So where you don't have any um, empty space, or you can just leave it empty, it's totally up to you. Or even if you want to use maybe a 40 inch by 30 inch board, you can always enlarge it. and make the whole use of this here um, sheet. All right, once again, I'm Nikki from Exotic Party Creations. I hope this video helped showing you how to edit your templates and your files once you receive them from us and also how to um, set your board up to send for us for printing your images. All right, until the next one.